Angela. Pascal, what do you feel like was so different for this in this game compared to game one for you guys? They had a couple stretches that were really long, and you guys couldn't respond like you did in game one. Yeah, no. Um, obviously, like you know, they. Yeah, I think they, I thought they played like they played a little bit better for more stretches than we did. Um, you know, they had a lot of good runs, and we just we, we was we was getting there close, but just quite not quite there. Um, now, Aaron and G wasn't where we was supposed to be. And um, yeah, like I mean, they had more rebounds, like all, everything, like you know. So they just played better than us, like. And um, yeah, we gotta look ourselves in the mirror and and, and move move on and and um, think about it the the next game. Drew, what did you think their defense was doing a little bit better tonight? It felt like you guys struggled to get the shots you wanted at times in this game. Um, I felt like it was a little bit maybe of a tighter paint. They kind of try to clog the paint a little bit more, make us play more like they switch a lot they do a lot of switching on and off the ball so it kind of keeps the matchups the way they kind of want it but I think if we if we move the right way and play with pace and get stops I think I think it's it's not gonna be a problem for us and if you guys don't have tie uh, didn't at times tonight what changes for you and what do you have to do better as a team I think we just need to continuously play with pace and move the ball and get to other actions I think we play well when we are kind of random and not just setting up certain certain, certain um, kind of plays and, and, and certain kind of uh, like ball screens or certain kind of sets and stuff. Yeah, uh, for both you guys either or um, you had it down to 68, 66. Um, was that kind of a stretch where Tyrese makes, you know, put you guys back over the hump and you knew that he was not going to be there? Um, what do you mean? Well, I mean, that's when you guys are able to make your, a serious run, and and it turns out Tyrese isn't, you know, he's your leader. So. Um, no, I mean, I think obviously we, we need Ty, but at, at the end of the day, you know, it's next up, next man mentality. Um, we we gotta we gotta be ready, and and we gotta you know play together. Um, this this team got to where we at tonight. I mean, where we at today? Um, it's by you know having all of us. Um, and and we all gotta. Um, stay together, continue to play together, um, uh, and obviously we want Tyrese back out there. But I think you know, obviously I, I don't, I, he wasn't feeling well, so it's it's on us to, con to, to, to continue to play and um, you know bring that energy. They obviously went small for a lot of this. You know, didn't didn't have a center in there. Used O'Shea uh, a lot. What? How did that kind of just change the dynamic? The degree to which they were just playing without a five man and and you know just keeping their. Um, I don't think it changed anything. I think uh, obviously I think like they did a lot of things better than we did. Um, uh, and and I don't. I mean, we got to continue to attack and, and do the things that we do. Um, but we just didn't do well enough to win tonight. So um, we got to take that and, um, like I said, move on to the next. Pascal here in the back. Uh, four games in seven days, three different cities. You had to dig out of that big hole. What kind of told that take on you in that fourth quarter of all the energy it expanded not only tonight but throughout this week? Yeah, it's hard. It's playoffs, baby. You know, that's what that's what you you know. I think for me especially, like. You know, last year I was sitting here watching this and being pissed, you know, and I wanted to be part of this. So um, it's a blessing. And no matter how tired you are, like, this is the, the, the stage you want to be in. Um, and, you know, there's, there's no excuse for that or, like, whatever. Like, we're here. Um, we want to compete at the highest level and, and try to win. And, and, you know, we're blessed to be playing at this, at this time of the year. Obviously, uh, Tyrese went out of the game for good in the third quarter, but it seemed like he wasn't feeling well all night. Did, did he convey to you guys that he wasn't right? And did you feel like you had to do a little more? Just mm, it seems like a Tyrese question. Oh, he's not up there. You guys are. Yeah, but yeah, I think Tyrese was, was ready to go. He was playing. Um, and I, I think he got hurt, you know, and that's that. Uh, guys, still undefeated at home in the playoffs. Uh, still undefeated at home in the playoffs. Um, you know, what are you expecting the environment to be like this weekend, and why have you guys been playing so much better uh, at Gamebridge? Um, uh, I think, you know, obviously uh, be, being at home, um, our fans, you know, um, they give us so much energy. Um, you know, like just just playing that, I think obviously for me, I'm experiencing now, you know, for the first times, like you know, the games is just so much more energy, and, and you know, they're so passionate about our team. Um, and we just, you know, like just go out there trying to compete. Um, to the best of our abilities, and you know we can't wait to, to see the fans out there um, on Saturday and, and and just see the energy that they're going to bring. 
um, you know, to support us, which they've done all year. Um, we're just so excited. I think, but more more important than that is just obviously losing losing sucks. And and for us, like once we lose, we want to go back and um, play better. And um, yeah, like that's the energy that we have going to the next game. And we got to give everything. You know, we got to give everything that we have, not only for us and for our team, but for our fans. Fellas, this is a battle of two of the top offenses in the NBA. Um, what do you get? What do you guys say to people who criticize your defense and say that's one of your weak points? Uh, I think I think our, our, our defense got a lot better, um, and and I think obviously for me coming in at, at that time of the year, and um, I, I can see the progress that the team has made, um, and you know everyone, the commitment from the coaches, from the players, um, and you know like we, we're here for a reason, you know like and and. Um, we're here because you know we did all the right things and we continue to do the right things and um and, and I'm proud of our guys, you know, like obviously Drew, big part of our defense, Aaron, um, Ty, like making efforts, um, Miles, like it just go down the line, you know, guys are getting better. Um and, and that's the that's the reason why we're here. Um and we're gonna continue to get better. Obviously tonight we, we it was it was it wasn't the game that we wanted to be, but now uh, we rectify it for the next game. What do you got? One quick follow. Uh, what are you guys seeing from Tatum? Like, it seems like he's he's doing everything but hitting three point shots. Like, you know, uh, what what's it like? You know, going against him when you know his three point shot isn't falling. I mean, we know he's a good player. He can score from a lot of different places on the court. You know, he likes to get to the three off the dribble. I think we've we've done a good job of throwing different guys on him and making it tough on him. Um, and we gotta keep making him take tough shots. Drew, just going back to the being undefeated at home since March, how do you use this as a reset and emphasize having confidence playing in the field house and that this series isn't over yet? Yeah, I mean, y'all said it was a long road trip. I think uh, it would be nice for all of us to get home, get in our own beds. And um, we're excited to play in front of our fans. It's going to be a big weekend with the, the race in there. So we can't wait to get back on the home court. Back now, but just want to talk a little bit at the end of the second quarter when you guys had already obviously fallen behind by a bunch. I think you had the last 10 points and I think 12 of the last 14. You talked before about wanting to be the guy in those circumstances when maybe things aren't working, being a guy that can get get a bucket. Just what did you see and what worked out in that stretch? Um, I think you know we got stops and we we started running a little bit and I think obviously you know it feels good when you know if you make a shot or whatever. But I think just the, the fact that we were just more aggressive, we got stops, we got rebounds, um, which we didn't do for for a good pass of the game. Um, but I, and again, like I, I told, I think however we want to play as a team, like I feel like I'm able to do that. Um, and, and if it's, you know, playing fast, I'm able to do that. If it's playing slow, I'm able to do that as well. So we just got to continue to play together, um, find ways to, to, again, we can be out rebounded and, and things like that against a team like, you know, like they're the best team in the league. So um, we got to get more possessions and um, we got to fight for that. We got to fight for everything. Last one on the right. Pascal, with the, with the way you guys can score, and the way you guys have erased deficits before. Was it tough not to be out there in the last last few minutes of that game, not trying to, uh, with, with the starters trying to trying to cut into that? No, I mean, I think we've, our depth is, is, is our depth has been, has been like everything for us and, and um, that's the way we play. And again, whoever is out there on the floor gotta, gotta step up and we gotta, um, we gotta be together and try to do our best. And um, yeah, like we just can't wait, you know, it's gonna suck. It's tonight, we're gonna, you know, losing and and I think we have the guys to understand you know how hard it is to win and and we know that we can bounce back and we've done it all, all, all year and um you know it's time to dig deep and and, and just go out there and, and compete at the highest level in front of our fans awesome thank you